actually, before we start swinging an ax around out in the woods, it's very important that we think about the resources around us. A simple log that just fell down like this with all these branches sticking off can be a super valuable resource. And we wanna think about those types of things to make camp life that much easier. Maybe we have other projects we wanna work on and we don't wanna to have to hassle with much. So while we're gathering firewood, thinking ahead can be very beneficial. Now, if you watch my videos at all, you know I love a good cook system. I love setting up different systems to boil water and cook food. But sometimes looking at something like this log right here that just came down off the top of the tree, this can become a cook system super quick. Number one, we have firewood. So before I do anything, I'm gonna limb this thing out. But I'm gonna leave one or two of these branches on this side that are somewhat straight, somewhat long, and in the middle of this trunk, I'm gonna leave them intact. I'm gonna take everything else off. And then with a three foot drag of that log, I have myself an entire workstation. All you really wanna do though is take some of those branches that you cut off and make some wedges. I'm gonna wedge each side just lightly so the log doesn't roll. And now my setup is complete. If I build a fire here with a small notch on this limb I left there, I have a pot hanger. On this side of the log, I can do some processing. And on this side, if you hew it flat, you have a smaller workstation for processing food or just sitting your butt next to the fire. Complete workstation from a resource that you would overlook normally. And that's it, a simple workstation out of a resource that we probably would normally just pass right by. So you always have to think, how can you use things in different ways other than what they appear to be? So I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, check us out at coldcrackerbushcraft.com. Check this out, try it on your own, and tell me how you like it. And as always, stay in the woods.